Say it again, Shatan needs the puck more. Blake for Yashin. Block, rebound, Paris. It's slithered wide. Blake again. Score! You'll see him watch the play. He starts going around the net, then stops to go after the puck. When he looked up, he made the decision, I'm going to just try and bank it in. And that's exactly what he does. He banked it in. Nidamaki saw it, put his glove up. And his face mask was there. His head was there as well. And Blake just said, I'm going to fire this backhand and try and, try and get lucky. And he did. Huge goal for the Islanders as they lead it one nut, or pardon me, as they've come back to tie it. Meyer back to protect it from Bates, who gets right back on him. Center and feet Paris. He scores! Oh, what a one-timer from Mark Paris. And the Islanders take up two to one lead. I'm telling you, this line's got something going. They've got something going. Bates makes a, makes a good play with his stick to lift the stick and to get the puck. But before he passes, he'll look up to see where Parrish is. Watch, there's the play. Now watch him look up. Little quick look. He knew Parrish was there, and, I, and it was an unbelievably perfect pass. There it is again, right here. He looks up briefly, sees Parrish over there, gives him a perfect pass, and Parrish put everything... Back to play. Hunter alone in front for a moment. Now Campoli fires. Deflect. They score! Hunter looked like he got a piece of it. And the Islanders regain the lead. 3-2. to two. You know, the Flyers were so aggressive... They were so aggressive, Campoli, or Campoli ended up shooting it, and you know what? Maybe it was only one deflection. That's our Panasonic digital replay. Here it is again. It'll deflect up high, right there, and then bounce down. There was a stick there, but I don't think Hunter touched it. It looked like it just stuck between the pads. There's the one deflection, bounce, redirection, oh, yeah, and then just so. underneath the pads. And that goal will go to Campoli. It will be a power play goal, a huge goal. I don't think Hunter touched it. I think it missed his stick. Eight. The Islanders are going to win it now. Here's Hunter looking at the empty net. Bingo! Hunter gets the goal, but how about Joel Bouchard? I'll tell you what, he is playing some big-time hockey. Joel Bouchard goes down to block this. He is spent right now. What a ship for him, and what a bad... His 11th game, he has perhaps his biggest impact and expends his largest amount of fuel. He's that wiped tank out. looks like... Yeah. Wiped what? out. A win that the Islanders had to have after they saw that Montreal won. But it's still somewhat profitable for New York because they move within just one point of Toronto, two points of Boston. They have games in hand on both of those teams. And you know, before the Islanders can get to that eighth slot, they've got to climb over that traffic in front of them. So, yes, Montreal might have won, and the Islanders might have seen another game go by the boards. But they win it, and they do gain ground on some of that traffic ahead of them.